Hi, I'm Cikgu Ikram from SMK Medini, the State Technical Officer for English Language Poetry Writing Competition for Secondary Schools. My partner, Cikgu Nur Farizan from SK Pasarai, is the State Technical Officer for English Language Poetry Writing Competition for Primary Schools. Now, the introduction um, for this competition it is aiming to encourage the use of English through meaning, sound, and rhythmic language of poems. This competition allows students to share their thoughts, stories, feelings, and experiences creatively. And this, in, this competition is according to the theme. The objectives of this competition is to improve people's creative writing skills, a platform for people to highlight their writing talents, and to cultivate pupils' interest in writing poems in English. Now, um, for primary schools, it is from year four to year six pupils. The lower secondary school is from, from form one to form three pupils. Upper secondary school, from form four and for form four and form five pupils, and form six college and class for form six pupils. Now, the theme. For primary and lower secondary category, which is year four to form three, is my utopia. And the upper secondary and form six category, which is from form four to form six, is overtake and surpass. Okay, so these themes are for district and state levels only. For national level competition, the MOE will provide new themes to the state educa education departments two weeks before judging. Okay, rules and guidelines. Only one poem under one category. The poems must be submitted in PDF file and uploaded via a link provided by the organizer. Poems must be the people's own work, authentic and original, and must never have been published or have won a prize in any other competition prior to this competition. The poems must not touch on sensitive issues of ethnic, race, and religion of any kind. All poems upon submission cannot be corrected or edited. It will go through district and state or national level without any editing incurred. The format for writing poems. Poems must only be presented with a title. Any personal information should only be in the entry form. The poems must be typed using Times New Roman font, size 12 with 1.5 spacing. Now, the line limit. For primary schools, it is 12 to 16 lines. For lower secondary school, it is 12 to 20 lines. For upper secondary school, it is 16 to 24 lines. And for, for form 6, College class, it is 16 to 24 lines. Right. So, poems will be reviewed by a panel of three to five judges appointed by the state education departments or the Ministry of Education. The, micro, the marking criteria is as such, content, 50 marks, and language, 50 marks. Judges will collectively determine the placing by a clear majority vote. Individual marks are confidential and will not be disclosed. All decisions are final and no appeal is allowed. So these are some, some samples of the rubric that, is, that can be found from the paperwork. I would like to point out that in this rubric, for the, the lowest band, Teachers must be aware that this is in the rubric. More prose than poetry. If the poem has more prose than poetry, then it will fall in this band. Please read the rubric carefully. Plagiarized writing will be disqualified. And rhyme is not a requirement. And failure to adhere to the specified number of lines will be graded a band lower. Now some FAQs. What if the poem is not written according to the format? For example, the font, size, and spacing. 
the judges may decide to grade the poem a band lower. Next, do bombastic words and rhymes in the poem help to score higher band? Not necessarily, because poetry is expressive. Though impressive use of language will be graded higher in the rubric, but there are many ways to use the language expressively. For example, figures of speech, descriptive imagery, different types of poetic poem, um, and different types of poetic forms. What considers as lines in a poem? For example, if you look there, the sample below has four lines. And, however, the sample below will be counted as two lines. That is all from me. Thank you very much.